Dot hello, everyone. Count here, and I'm here to share my thoughts on the British royal family. Today, my focus is on Harry and Meghan, with just a touch on the more critical topic of Prince Andrew. Do I believe there's a connection? Absolutely, but right now, all eyes are on Meghan's silver outfit, and Harry seems a bit unhappy. Their recent appearance at Beyonce's concert was clearly staged to emphasize that Meghan and Harry are still deeply in love. Harry even wore her jacket, and apparently, silver attire was the dress code. Doria's presence was reminiscent of Meghan's earlier efforts to capture Harry's heart, but times have changed. It's all for show. Harry's current default expression seems to be one of disinterest, a significant shift for someone of royal lineage. Meghan had the opportunity for it all, but now she's just like everyone else, dancing to the tunes of her idol. While Meghan didn't seem stressed, it was evident she was trying hard to convince us they're still in love, but Harry appears quite the opposite. During a dance, Meghan leans in for a kiss while Harry seems to be moving away, a staged moment. The presence of someone strategically positioned to capture videos of them wasn't a coincidence. The real focus should be on Prince Andrew and the shocking revelations, which I believe are true but too sensitive for this channel. Prince Andrew's files won't be made public by the Foreign Office until 2065, but it will likely surface sooner. Questions arise about his return to public life, which will happen but not in the way people expect. It's just the beginning of a larger story that will soon be known to everyone. Prince Andrew will no longer have secrets, but expect to see more of him as they try to rehabilitate his image, a case of closing the door after the horse is bolted. As for the Harry and Meghan show, it's a distraction from Prince Andrew's situation. People seem more interested in what Harry and Meghan were doing at Beyonce's concert, but it's more of the same. Questionable acting on both their parts, Meghan trying to appear in love and a good dancer, while Harry hides his disappointment about Netflix and seems to have disdain for Meghan, which the camera occasionally captures. There's a vocal army of Harry and Meghan fans fighting back, emphasizing their love through body language. But it all appears scripted, from Harry wearing a woman's jacket to the presence of Meghan's mother, Doria. It's all part of their act, and there are doubts about the authenticity of some photos. While these videos were real, Meghan's attempt to get backstage to see Beyonce didn't go as planned. She kept emphasizing her identity and their supposed friendship, but it didn't work. Harry's behavior suggests he may despise Meghan. His attempts to gain sympathy and attract attention from real heroes seem questionable. The whole scenario still feels staged, with Harry wearing Meghan's jacket to draw attention. Meghan's apparent exclusion from backstage at the concert is a stark contrast to her earlier excitement about Beyoncé. Harry's complaints about not receiving support after returning from Afghanistan also raise doubts. What are your thoughts on this? Share your comments, and I'll see you in the next one. Thanks for watching. Bye.